the inflation numbers are in. Uh, well, the day before the CP lie was uh, pull, put out, uh, the race car driver came out and did a and did a speech and tried to get us ready for uh, for the CP lie numbers. And you guys know who the race car driver is. And he went up there and let me say this. Uh, I thought Jerome Powell last week, last Wednesday, had the biggest um, had the biggest truck of a uh, biggest dump dump truck full of cow manure in, in the country. But I I I, I was wrong. The, the race car driver got out of his race car and went into a uh, into a, a bigger dump truck than Jer Jerome Powell because he put so much manure. He poured it all over the country with that with that with that speech he gave. This man didn't take accountability for anything. I don't even know how he made it through the um <laughs> through the speech. This is this is this is this is comical but it's scary, man. I mean, what do you think other people are how are how are they, how they're looking at our country? You know, when, when we have someone when we got the race car driver leading us, man. It's just it's 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 insane, man. So let's talk about the CP lie numbers. I knew for a fact that the, it, the numbers are going to be lower than what they were. You talking about cooking the books? The cooks were out today, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, boy, they had the best chefs in the world to lower inflation from what it was last month. I mean, still bad, eight point three uh, month over month from April twenty twenty one to April twenty twenty two, but it's nowhere near what it really is. And guys, they might keep doing this. They might keep lowering it little by little by, by lying to us and cooking the books. Uh, whoever's doing those books, I want them to do my taxes, I swear, because they're they're good at numbers. That's all I got to say. Um, but what they'll do is inflation will be going up, the real numbers, and do them yourself. You know, go to the grocery store when you go and, and, and calculate the numbers and write down the dates and put them down. And then the next time you go, write them down again and keep doing it, your own numbers, and you'll see. At the grocery store, at the pump, rent, whatever. Your basket of goods that you buy every day, week, month, and quarter. Uh, do your own numbers. And uh, just just know, that, just know that we're being lied to, ladies and gentlemen. Okay? Uh, we all know that inflation has nothing to do with the scamdemic. With with the guy over in, uh, over there in Europe, uh, you know, fighting the other country. Um, has, has nothing to do with that. You know, but meanwhile, we're 30 and a half trillion dollars in debt, but we're sending 40 billion dollars that we printed out in thin air to a country that I feel bad for. Don't get me wrong. And I don't want anything to happen to them, but that has nothing to do with us. We have absolutely nothing to do with that. And while we're struggling, that's almost like being a homeless person and being in all this debt and then going and counter going and counterfeiting money literally counterfeiting money because that's what they're doing and just going and giving it away you know what i mean like instead of actually spending it because you can spend this counterfeit money and uh instead of spending on himself or his family or getting clothes or food or helping his his own household and getting his own uh affairs in order he gives it to some gives it to somebody else and that's exactly what we're doing so when you hear the race car driver up there talking and barely getting through a speech um, you already know, don't, don't listen to that. And, uh, it's scary, man. I, I know people joke and, and stuff like that, but I'm a, I'm a proud American. I'm a, I'm a veteran of this, of this great United States of America. I was in the U United States Navy. And, uh, all I got to say is, man, our forefathers right now, they're, uh, they're, they're rolling over in our graves, man. They, uh, they worked so hard to get us to where we're at. And it's just crazy how, we have all this technology and all this stuff, but we're, we're, we're behind the eight ball. We got so many smart people in this world um, that are dumb and they listen to the, to, the, to the dumb stuff. And there's so many distractions that uh, it's crazy. As long as they tell you something's going on, they'll just, you'll just go along with it. And whatever the next narrative is, that's where we go. Because it's always something else besides what's really going on look over here look over there do this do that watch this watch that don't do this don't do that and as long as you're doing what you're told and you don't put your phone down or what turn off the tv um you're going to be a puppet <laughs> okay 
but do your own research, do your own due diligence. And I don't have to tell you guys that. I'm talking to you um, to tell your, 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 your folks that, your family, your, your loved ones, the ones that are closest to you. Because I'm telling you, if, if you know what hits the fan, um, you gotta have them ready and you gotta be ready. In order to have them ready, you gotta be ready mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually, everything. Um, commodities, guys, commodities. The CP lie lied to us. Okay, that number says 8.3. It's it's way in the double digits. It might be 25, 30%. Who knows? At the, at the gas pump, it's double. If we're talking about b before the scamdemic started and they sat everybody down and kept them at home and printed out all the money, uh, all the cash and all that, if you started from there, because we were already going to shit before that, um, things have doubled, tripled. So that's, that's 100, 200, 300 percent inflation in real in real time. So get your stuff together. Um, man, this is going to be tough, man. This market is, is ridiculous. I'll talk about that in the next video. So um, stay tuned, stay focused and uh, keep your head on the swivel. All right, guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Uh, please, guys, um, always stay ready if you don't have to get ready. And uh, let me know what you guys think about what's going on in the market, okay? And what's going on in this world today. Uh, please, guys, in the comment section below. Do me a favor, guys. If you like this video, hit the like button only if you like it. If you like my channel and my videos, go ahead and share it. Guys, am I sharing stuff with you? I'm pouring my heart out to you guys. I got a couple more videos coming too, so I'm definitely sharing. So um, at least you can do is share my videos because we already know. Sharing is caring. And you guys know I love you very much, guys and girls. You guys are my boys. You know that. Hey, keep your head up. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Get 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 the canned foods. Get the water. Uh, push ups, sit ups. Go running. If you have to walk a long time, get your backpack. Get your get your right shoes. Get everything, man. You know what I mean? Don't spend your money or your cash on bullshit. Get the necessities. Get the commodities. And what are the commodities? Things that you need on an everyday basis. Because whether nothing happens or not, if something happens or not, or whatever. You're still getting it at today's prices, all right? It's better to get it now than later. Remember, do something today that your future self would thank you for, all right? I'll talk to you guys soon. Peace and love, guys.